dear Irene. Dear Vera. Oh, here's the letter for me. I did very much enjoy your company at the reception. I've certainly not danced a tango like that in years. And if a mother can't get tipsy at her only daughter's wedding... <laughs> Life has just become so hectic since Bill's been paying me attention. <laughs> Bingo! What are you doing at Christmas? I dare say Bill will want to see me over the holidays. Bill suggested that the three of us might go away for a weekend. Bill and I never meant to end up in bed together. But as he said to me afterwards, he thought I was a bolster. Karen is pregnant. I've had to stop and have something stiff. Thank heavens for Howard. Thank heavens I've got one child I can be proud of. Karen confided in me about Howard. I must admit, I had started to wonder. Mm. Not in my backyard hooligans went on the rampage today when they stormed onto the 18th tee at Grosthorpe Golf Club. During the action, an allegedly sex-mad granny attacked a bulldozer. Irene came out of her coma early last week. Coma? Since then, she has regrettably become extremely foul-mouthed. I simply <laughs> and said to him, stealing from defenceless old fecking ladies will make your dick drop off. Grosthorpe Police Station. Dear Vera, I am in dire straits and need your help. I've always wanted to visit one of Her Majesty's residences. I was remanded in custody, awaiting trial, which could take anything up to two years. I'm here because of Karen. I've just heard on the grapevine that you and I are in the same boat. They suspect me of being an international drugs runner. <laughs> We're doing a full-scale production of Guys and Dolls. You'd be surprised what you can do with a bit of brown paper and sellotape. Would anybody like my sausage? Hey, it's for eating. Do as I did. Declare yourself insane, and you'll be off that prison ship in an instant. La, la, la. I must say, the prospect of seeing any of you again fills me with horror. Is this house haunted? <laughs> Apart from that, Everything goes on as normal. It's just like old times, really. And yet somehow strangely different. Mm. 